this is what I've been waiting for for a long while now mule deer, non-typical he's not a very big one but I just hope there's some wolves around so I just really really hope that he doesn't spook so that's what I've been waiting for for quite some time now um, I've got a white tail and I've got a black tail non-typical but I'm yet I'm yet to get a mule deer. Just hope this one comes in. I just hope he is. He's not, as I say, he's not a, not a fantastic one, but at least I can mount him in my lodge if he comes in and he plays ball. Now, the only thing is, I haven't got an ethical weapon, only a bow. So I'm just hoping that he's going to play ball and he's going to come in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to centre press and just in case he does do a wiggle giggle um, we've got two here. We've got a uh, one at the front and a non-typical at the back. It's got some twisted horns. It's about 30, 37 metres away but at least I can uh, I can hang him in my lodge. Uh, I've been hunting quite, quite a long time for one of these. I just hope that it's going to pay off and I can get him. So I'm going to let him come in. Next time he stops, I'm going to try and get him. Hopefully this bush is not going to be in the road. Um, no, 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 I don't want him in the bush. So stand there, fella. That's it. Let's see if I can get him through the bush. Damn it, was a poor shot. Well, I hit him with the bow. I tried to hit him in the chest. Uh, I'm not too far away from me. Um, I'm not too far away from uh, my tent. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let him get the run out of his system. That was because I was tr trying to not trying to compensate for that, um, well I got him in the heart lung so that's okay, that's good so I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try and track him down I got him in the heart lung, I'd see I smacked him in the chest because um, he did move his head to one side so that paid dividends for me so he shouldn't run too far, but as I say, got, I've got um, blood loss on my um, on my skills. So I just hope he's gone down so I can take a really, really nice trophy shot. So he shouldn't have run too far. And I've got a Roosevelt elk. So he might just... What's this? Yeah, he's not too far. He's 36 health. So he did. I probably hit him in the. I probably hit him in the. Just trying to work it out. I probably hit him in the right lung. Because uh, he did scratch. And he did twist his head around to one side. Really chuffed about this. Because as I say, I just wanted to get one of these. One of these mule deer. And then what I might do is I might mount him and put him in the lodge. Put him in my rare lodge. And that was unexpected, that was. I've uh, got two lots of tracks here. Maybe that was his incoming track. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is his incoming track. If you can see the footprints are facing that way so it's roaming so he did roam around that way to me when I did call um, I weren't expecting this actually because as I say when I hunt wolves I normally use the mule deer as a decoy now what's going on here 
I normally use the uh, mule deer as an early warning call that the, there's uh, wolves around. So I can't see him going back to roaming. What's this? Yeah, this is fleeing. So he's fleeing that way. Uh, that's poo. So yeah, he's fleeing this way. It doesn't help when you've only got one eye, but there you go. Shit happens. Some moments later. <coughs> right, okay. I think is that's not him, is it? No, that's not him. That's not him, Marv. Take my time. It's no good rushing these things. Take my time. There's another... I'm going to jog on up here, actually. Uh, that was a roaming track. What's this? I want some more blood, actually, because we've got 37%. So is this fleeing? Yeah, this is fleeing. So, yeah, I'll possibly only snag one lung. So... Uh, he not probably not run too far. Um, but then again, he might have. So, looks like that's him here. Is that him? And we're in the dark part, so we're not going to really get a decent trophy shot. Damn it. Really wanted him to go down somewhere else, actually. I could pull him out to here. Um, the sun has gone in, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to police him up. I'm going to wait for the sun to come out. So, there you go, get into the right position. And police him up. What size is he? Yeah, he's a 150, 153. Now, I don't know whether that's good or bad, actually. So, a 153. So, anyway. There we go. Always take my time with trophy shots. Always take my time. Never pays to quickly do a trophy shot. Now, I've just got a, I've just got a grizzly bear call. It's a bit of a, um, it's a bit of a, uh, there we go. It's a bit dark in here, so I'm going to select the weapon that I um, shot him with. So there you go, get in, get in with the foliage. Try and get him as, um, try and get him there. Like that. It'd be nice if the sun was out, but I can always do the filter. So there you go. It'd be nice if I could maneuver my head and like you can maneuver the uh, specimen so I'm going to do a little bit of a filter to try and sharpen it up so there you go actually I'm not happy with that not happy with that Marv let's do, a, let's do one round here there you go so I've got a little bit of the foliage in so I'm going to take my time as I say I don't like rushing trophy shots. Get the animal where you like it. Come on, play ball, fella. No, nope, he's not going to play ball. So, I'm going to get him like that. No, he ain't going to play ball. Right, here we go. Let's go around. I know what I normally do is if he's not going to play ball, I normally go around the back and pull him and then lift him from the back. Because uh, what I was doing, I was grabbing his arms. So I lift him from the back. Uh, he says, Marv, and he's goosing it all up. But go around the front. It's a bit better. We've got a general idea of what that is. 
Uh, and don't be frightened of going in too close, just because those horns are out of the fo out of the line, um, out of this square box. If you can see the box that's got the white handles on the outside, don't be frightened because those, when you actually take the shot, that um, that doesn't uh, affect the actual trophy shot. Because there you go. Now I'm going to do the filter. Now the sun's starting to come out, so I'm going to do the filter. So there you go, I've sharpened, sharpened it up the best I can. I'm going to accept it. And you damn straight, I'm going to taxidermy it. So I'm going to use my GMs. And there you go, uploading photograph. So there you go. That's me, Marv. Um, I will possibly do uh, one and show, um, show him in the actual lodge with the rest of me. Uh, with the rest of me uh, animals that I've got in my rear lodge. Hello fellow hunters, um, here to show you my non-typical but uh, I got uh, a few minutes ago non-typical mule deer um, and here we go. Well see that someone's keeping the fire in. Um, got it some moments ago. I've actually done a full melt in one of my trophy lodges and I'm going to go into this one and show you him um, I possibly will transfer this is a lodge that I got on sale actually so I'm going to possibly put all my trophies in here being as how well, this is a bigger and better lodge so this is the mule deer that I just got uh, as you saw on camera um, been trying to get one of these for ages and I finally got one it's got a peculiar little twist there on that little horn there and he's not he's not that big he's only he's only a 153 um, not looks on the leaderboard which are mule deer non-typicals um, but there you go I've been trying to get one of these for an age um, I will show you my other ones that I've got uh, in my other lodge, in my rare lodge. So bear with me. So we just pop out of this one. Now I've, I was in multiplayer game, so I've had to go out uh, from uh, multiplayer game and come into single player game because you can't um, you can't go to your lodge and put in your trophies that you've just got. So this is my other trophy. This is the uh, this is a piebald moose that I got on White Rhine Ridge, and that is my silver tip, which I won uh, first place with uh, back in 2017. Uh, this is a white moose. I'm looking for uh, his boyfriend with antlers. That's me, piebald. Uh, Red deer. This is my albino bear. Albino brown bear. There's Rudolph. He's not really a rare, but he's Rudolph. There's um, red fox. I think that is. Um, it says it's a grey, but that came up as a mealistic. I don't know why. Um, here's my um, white tail, non-typical, and there is. You can't really get a good look at him but because he's right up there but trust me that is a non-typical black tail which I got in red feather falls so there you go that's me Marv oh ah last but not least this is the silver tip which I got in White Rhine Ridge so there you go no I didn't I'm Heimendal duh uh, so there you go that's me Marv and I will catch you in the next one goodbye Take care.